Hey guys, it's a Shane with OBQs, creators of the DigiQ and the new DigiQ Blue. In this video, we're going to talk about uh, how to customize the DigiQ app to set it up just the way you want it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to settings. We're going to click on Shane's DigiQ Blue uh, or whatever you've called your device. We're going to click on edit at the very top and we're going to edit configuration. We're now on the configuration screen. So let's look at the settings. I'm actually in intermediate mode right now. So let's say I want to go to advanced mode. We can do that and we can just sync on advanced mode. We go ahead and push the power button two times and it'll sync to advanced. Well, advanced is a pre, there are predetermined settings that we believe are perfect for an advanced configuration. But some of those settings may not apply to you or you might want to change them. For example, backstroke pause is currently set at a tenth of a second. If you're somebody that has a very pronounced and long backstroke pause, uh, most snooker players have one, a lot of pool players have them. Um, maybe you want a half second backstroke pause before you pull the trigger or you want to work on developing one. So you can click on a half second and then you can save that. So now what we've done, I'm going to go ahead and sync that. Push the power button two times to sync. What we've done is we've taken the stock advanced level out of the box, but we've made one modification to it. We've, we've made a, a half second backstroke pause and we're now in a custom configuration. Uh, we can actually go back again and if we decide we want to make any additional changes, um, let's say we want to turn everything off and not record anything. <laughs> Sounds a little weird, right? Well, I can take straightness and I can put straightness on extreme. Straightness is literally measuring the up and down and left and right of the cue. So if I save extreme straightness, it's actually one of my favorite things to do because we've turned everything off, but we're only measuring perfect, perfect straightness of the cue. You can see it actually says we're in a custom mode. So if we look at the configuration that we're set in now, everything is turned off except for straightness on extreme. I actually challenge you guys all to do this. Uh, it's extremely difficult. Uh, extreme is a very well named uh, level. Um, but just shoot a shot. Shoot any one of a number of shots and it will only record straightness and it will give you a score from 0.0, .0 all the way up to 10.0. Anything 9 or above is, is world class. So I encourage you to try different shots on extreme. Take a screenshot of your result and, and email it to us. Send it to feedback at obqs.com and we'd love to, um, we'd love to see the results. Um, we're going to have some pro players do the exact same thing and you're going to be able to compare your scores to, to pro players. So I think it's going to be really cool for people to be able to compare themselves to their friends and also some of the top pros. So that's it. That's how you customize the configuration screen on the DigiQ app. Thanks, guys.